Well, ain't this a kick to the ships? What's going on here? Just making sure Hedda ends up on top. I got a lot riding on this. It took four of these babies to stop you, so I figured if I use just one on Shea Vizsla, the odds get much better for me. <laughs> Hedda doesn't know about this, of course. Don't want to step on her precious honor. Shut it off. Wait, wait, wait! Hear me out! If Hedda wins, I get a huge payday! Huge! You let me finish this my way, and Darmanda walks away from Hedda's pointy horns and anything to do with the hidden chain. She loses our support. You understand me? Hey, hey, I'll even sweeten the deal. Darmanda supplies your side a fat discount on weapons, supplies, whatever, for the war. Huh. Hmm. Between you and me, she ain't looking too good. You might as well get something out of this. Walk away. And that is Hedda's fleet arriving. Let me guess. Your fleet? We're out of time. Leave right now and Darmanda drops out of this and backs your side instead. So, what's it gonna be? This will be a fair fight, no matter the cost. Thought you were smarter than this. Only an idiot passes up a sure thing. This is about honor. You wouldn't understand. Just cost me a lot of credits. I can live with that.
keep giving me the chance to kill you. And you keep missing, Takar! Thanks. Things just went from bad to worse. They're retreating. Do not pursue. I repeat, do not pursue. What about Heta's fleet? We used that storm to launch an ambush of our own. It wasn't pretty, but it put them on the run. Mandalore, can you hear me? Takaya? I'm right here. We're getting you out. Where is she? Heta's gone. Hartuk! It's not over. We'll find her. You can bet on that. Just tell her, Ras. I dislike secrets. Speak. An old enemy has crawled out of the muck. Rakan. He's the one who singled me out during the fight. I swore I'd kill him the next time I saw him. What's the story there? Two years ago, Rakan was part of a group helping the imps on Belsavis. They were good. Experienced, skilled, all that. The Republic hired their own team to stop them. Our... Our sister Layla was in charge. There were casualties, for both sides. The imp mission failed, but Rakan escaped. Layla didn't make it. Rakan blamed us, all of Clan Ordo, for his failure. We didn't understand why a mercenary took things so personally. It's clear now. He was part of Hedda Cole's inner circle. He's responsible for losing her best people on Belsavis. He failed her, not just the mission. My condolences. I didn't know. Layla was a Mandalorian. 
she died as well as any warrior could ask, with a weapon in her hand and facing the enemy. I can see her, holding that old training blade she never got rid of, swearing a streak as they came at her. Grinning, eyes bright. Come, we should see how Mandalore fares. How's she doing? Her wounds are significant, but she is recovering. You should talk with her. I'm fine, Jakaya. This new implant will take some getting used to, but I don't need a nursemaid. That's for the best. None would put up with you as a patient, Great Mandalore. All of those battles have loosened your brain, as well as your tongue, wise arbiter. Ah. Uh. Sorry to interrupt. We got nothing. After Hedda's fleet disengaged, they jumped. Could be anywhere. Did we find anything at the base? Not much. Those techs you ran into were happy to go through Hedda's systems, so we'll keep searching. Hard proof aside, it's clear that Rakan's sister, Sahar, is working with Hedda. And she has a Sith relic. That can't be good. Malgus wanted it, and now Hedda has it. I need to put her in the ground before this gets any worse. And now for some good news. Tales of your victory have traveled faster than the best smuggler ships. A humiliating defeat makes good entertainment. Can't argue with that. But Mandalore, why did you stop me from mentioning Hedda's machine? It was clearly there for her to cheat. I don't believe she was behind it. Her reputation would suffer. If the machine was used on me, I wager it was shut down in time. Wouldn't you agree? I wanted a fair fight. A risky move, considering the wounds I had taken. My life or my honor. The choice was always clear, Shay. You think like a Mandalorian. The duel was always mine to win or lose. No excuses. Hedda Cole and her hidden chain will need more than that to tear the Mandalorians apart. The hunt continues. Nothing will stand in my way. Shay Vizsla proved more resourceful than I anticipated. She won. With all my plans, all my preparation, she still won. This was always a test, Field Marshal. One that you passed. A secret duel on a fringe planet. This won't be a secret for long. That only helps our cause. Win or lose, you stood your ground, and Shay needed a whole fleet to rescue her. Your movement, all of this. Became real. Very real, yes. My base is gone, and she's victory salting my wounds. We must prepare for war, even as we retreat. I trust you will see us through. What do you propose? My sister has knowledge of a powerful new weapon. Rakan! What? Am I wrong? You hold the key. That was just between us. You promised to help me. I will. There is nothing more important to me. But this weapon, it's too dangerous. Then people with honor should control it. We both know the cost of being powerless. A weapon? Is this true, Sahar? Yes. Darth Malgus himself has his eye on it. Intriguing. Rikan. Make sure no one interrupts us. 